We are in London, Ontario, Canada today at the London Police Headquarters. Had a couple tips that uh, cops around here are not too friendly, so let's, uh, let's see if they respect our rights. All right, so at the back now, no trespassing, area monitored by video surveillance. The use of audio or video record equipment on this property is prohibited without authorization of the London Police Services. So what that sign is essentially saying is that they have no accountability, no transparency. You can't record yourself making a, for example, like police report or something. on guys before we get into this video i just wanted to let you know that i switched my style up a little bit in this video based off the tips i received about the london police they're not too friendly they're full of tyranny so if you're wondering why it was a little more standoffish in this video that's the reason and you'll see why else in a minute let's go hey how's it going not bad is there a reason you're videotaping back here i can't really hear you too well sure i'll hop up and talk to you Is there a reason you're videotaping cars back here? Yeah. Can I ask what that is? No. Okay. What's your name? Constable Had Gambas. Thanks. You don't have a body camera? You guys don't have body cameras? No. I'm just wondering why you're videotaping the cars. Okay. Is there a reason? Do you have a dash cam? No. No. No, no video, audio recording at all? Ah, wow, that's crazy. So I'm just wondering why you're videotaping the cars coming in now. Yeah, I know. You asked me that like three times. I know we haven't answered yet. Yeah, I don't have to answer. Okay. I'm just out enjoying my day. Okay. Just, just understand that you're putting yourself in a weird position, right? You're standing in the back of the police station yeah. recording vehicles coming out. So is that dangerous? No, it's not dangerous. It's just an odd why, position. Why is it weird? In, right? why, why? Why would that be weird? Because of, we're going to wonder why you're doing that. We just want to make sure. Okay, yeah. There's nothing odd going on. You have two cameras. Just something I can help you with? There's no, not at all. Do you have you. a bottle of water? Oh, I don't have one with you. They might want to have the front desk. You have the front desk. Well, I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to record in the lobby. So, anyways, is there anything I can help you with, man? Yeah, I need some water. Can you okay. get me some water? Go to the front. Am I allowed to record in the lobby? Uh, not inside. I don't believe so. Why is that? It's private property. It's so private want, property. Yeah, so they won't let you record inside. Isn't there like public parking? Yeah, if you want to stay in the parking lot and do that, you'll you'll be outside. You're okay to do it there. You just can't bring it inside the building. So, the pu the police public the, so the police lobby is private. Yeah, it's private property inside the it's building. It's not for like citizens to go in and report crimes. No man, I don't know. Why. No? No, you can't do that. You can't have real video report now. A you citizen can can't go. A can a citizen go in and report a crime? I said. Yeah, you can go in and report a crime. You just can't videotape inside the lobby. Okay, so it would be public then. No, you can't videotape inside the lobby. I just mentioned Well, that. You, sure, you can well, say that, but it would be public property, you though. You. you see me videotape. I just want to make sure you're all right. Yeah, I need some I water. Do? Can I get some water? Like I said, if you want to go to ask the front desk, you can try up there. I don't have water with me. Sure. Any other, anything else you have yet? You know how many times you've asked me that now? And you haven't Constable? Do I have to answer it? Okay, I'm just out here recording and enjoying my day. Hey, have a conversation with him. Back off. I don't have to back, back off. Hey, I'm don't touch me. With him. I can right. walk up and like, no, listen. Don't touch me, sir. Him. What's your name? What's your name and badge number? Will I be arrested back if off. I approach? I will arrest you if you don't back off. You will arrest me if I don't yeah, back off. I'm having a conversation here. We're investigating if you're trespassing or not. I'm allowed to stand right here. and back I'm, off. In, I'm having a private conversation. That's twice you put your hands on me now. That's twice you put your hands on me now, constable. Do you agree with that? He's allowed to put his hands on me? Conversation. And I'm allowed. I'm allowed to listen to the conversation. Am I not? Yes, I am. So arrest me then. You know what you're talking about. Shut up or arrest me. With all due respect. Shut up or arrest me. I'm allowed to listen. Shut up or arrest me. Shut up or arrest me, constable. Right? You guys are clearly not friendly. I'm a friendly guy, but I give the same respect that I get, and I'm not getting any respect. Arrest me or shut up. 
people that you're not being respectful. They're asking me to shut up. I don't care, right? If you're telling me to shut up, that's you had your chance. You're defending him. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. You agree with him that he put his hands on me. That's if he felt threatened by you. That's his. Shut up or arrest me, right? Shut up or arrest me, right? What's your badge number, Constable Devlin? Pardon me? He's a staff sergeant. So does that give him the right to put his hands on civilians? Oh, okay. So no, it doesn't give him the right to put his hands on me, though. You just said no, but now you're switching it off. Blue line. Where's your blue line badge? You got one? You seem like you ride with it. I'm very friendly with the police. Other than when you come and put your hands on me. You'll know who I am soon enough, right? You'll know that I am very respectful. I'm a very cordial guy. I don't have to give you my name. At this point, I don't want to give you my name. I'm going to file a complaint on Constable Devlin here. Staff Sergeant. Yeah, I'm well aware of that. Lika, can you get me a complaint form? Yeah, they're at the front desk. Can, I can escort you around there if you want. Do we have to walk around the Oh, outside? no, that's fine. I'm here for Constable Devlin now. Put his hands on me. You can, he can't put his hands on me. You can make a complaint online or we can walk around to the front and get it for him if you like. I know but how to do it, sense. Constable, right? Thanks. Okay. You should stand up for what's right, Constable, right? Seems like you're trying to start an argument with us. He was trying to find out if you were here lawfully or not. We find it kind of, we get a concern when people are reporting police vehicles. You can understand that, right? Is it illegal? No, but if, if okay. you were recording, if someone was reporting you leaving your workplace or leaving your home, would you be concerned? I think that's a legitimate concern, don't you think? Like if I'm if I'm leaving work or I'm driving a police car and someone's reporting me or looking at license plates, that's why we're wondering. Usually it's not for legitimate purposes. It's to target police or harm someone. We want to make sure the people that work here are safe and they can go home and be uh, able to carry out their job without threat, right? So it seems like you're trying to start something by reporting us. Is there something you'd like to make a complaint about? Or that you'd like to report to the police? You're a coward, Devlin. Okay. You're a coward. Put your hands on me. I'm a law-abiding citizen. I did nothing wrong. So Doesn't matter. You're on a public sidewalk. If you want to make it private, go to your property. You're on a public sidewalk having a private conversation. How does that make any sense? What's that? How does that make any private, sense, I said. Investigating a possible offense and it's a private conversation. So go, privilege. so don't talk on a public property then. Do you not understand no, common sense? Do you know what the Canadian Charter Rights is? Right, One of those guys, yeah. Okay. We're happy to help you if you have something. I'm on the property, you're going to be arrested. I'll see you soon, Devlin. Okay. You f***ed with the wrong one today, Devlin. Enjoy your drive of shame, brother. We could have had a way better conversation, man. Could have had a way better conversation. Yeah, but your, your, but your buddy here had to come and put his hands on me. I was but your buddy here had to come put his hands on me. Do you agree with that? But you got what you want, right? You want Do you agree? Cents, you want your five minutes of fame? You got it. You guys recorded. A couple officers showed up. And put their hands on me, which is illegal. Your YouTube. You're cool for 10 minutes. It is what it is, man. Like, you're at the back of the police station recording. We're just asking you what's going on. Is there a problem? Can we help you? That's literally what we have to do. Yeah, and I told you I didn't want to answer that. And you just had to, you just couldn't let your ego go. You had to get an answer from me. Yeah, you had to get an answer from me. You couldn't just drive away. I've been nothing but blind to speaking to you, man. Me too. outside your house recording, you'd ask the same thing. You'd be like, what's going on? Constable, I've been polite, cordial, respectful as well until your officer here put his hands on me. Do you agree with that? Do you have any other questions for me? Yeah, do you agree with him putting his hands on me? It is what it is, man. It is what it is, huh? Can I do anything else for you, man? That's why you guys don't have body cams, huh? Yeah. All right, man, have a better day. Thanks, Constable. All right. You too. Be safe out there, man. How's it going, Constable? Sarge, thank you. Hey, Sarge. How's it going, Sarge? Good. Can I get your name? No. No? No. You don't have a conversation? Absolutely not. Get out of here.
fuck you. I said, absolutely not, get out of here. What a f coward. Ladies and gentlemen, I was here for maybe one minute flat, maybe two. That's it. Got approached by the first constable. Then the second one rolls up. Then I walk up within about a meter of them and he pushes me back physically. All right, so it's a day or two later from when Staff Sergeant Devlin put his hands on me. So I'm back at nighttime. It's been a while since we've done a little night session. Hope you guys are doing well. Thanks for all the love lately. 